um, in isolation. Because who doesn't love a quiz? Even if you're not gluten free, try these. The isolation blows have hit. Because it's about a thousand degrees in here. Fancy water with some strawberry syrup and some strawberries in it. This vlog is going to be ridiculous. Just apologies. Hello vlog. Happy Saturday. Welcome back. It is Saturday the 3rd and I'm in isolation. If you watched last week's vlog you'll know that. Um, but you know it's been quite nice actually. It is a very horrible rainy day here in Scotland. Are we surprised? Of course not. But I have been very busy, I've been very crafty, doing some more sewing and stuff this afternoon. And also, Angela has got me lots of lockdown treats. <laughs> it's very cute. All my favourite sweets. Some mojitos, this one's a frozen one, that might be interesting. Some cute hand sanitizer, and a Harry Potter quiz. Because who doesn't love a quiz? So yeah, isolating, I think, until next Thursday. So, <laughs> you know, that's fun. But actually, I, I don't think it'll bother me too much. I think I'll just keep super busy. Uh, lots, lots of good fun things you can do in isolation. It's only Saturday. We'll see how where it goes. You never know. Uh, anyway gonna get on I think I might watch Mamma Mia here we go again uh, don't ask me why but I'm just in that mood I just am I know this is, why does the light keep changing this is please tell me you all are seeing this and I have not completely lost the plot <laughs> weird I, I did that again I swear, I, I'm going to watch this back. I've not edited this. That is so bizarre. Wow. <laughs> I've actually speechless. That's so weird. That's never happened before. Anyway, going to get on with the rest of my night. Um, I'll come back and check in with you all tomorrow and see what's up. Hello, everybody. Happy Monday. It is quarter past twelve. Where did that morning go? I have no idea. I've just been keeping busy. Uh, as far as isolation goes, I'm actually fine. Um, I know a lot of people have been bored out of their minds, but I'm actually keeping really busy. Like I said, where did that morning go? Who knows? I, but yeah, I've been very crafty. I've been making some scrunchies. I have been doing Sudoku, just all things like that, colouring in, reading, you know, watching. I've watched so much Friends, so much, <laughs> in the last, like, week, but there's nothing else for it in isolation, so, you know, it is what it is. Uh, but also, any gluten-free friends, you need to try these. Angela got me these in, like, a wee care package, and I, uh, wow just wow that's all i need to say if you're gluten free try these even if you're not gluten free try these that's all i'm gonna say outstanding uh my nails are not looking the best so i think at some point take them off do a new set because you know not like i'm doing anything else <laughs> but that's fine uh yeah so it's quarter past twelve. I'm going to go and have some lunch. I honestly don't even know where that morning went. It wasn't like I woke up late. I was up at like half past seven. I really don't know. Anyway, that's what's happening for now. I'll come back in a wee while. I doubt anything will be dramatically different, but I'll see you soon. Hello, everybody. Happy Tuesday. You might be thinking, Nicola, what are you doing right now? I'm currently walking laps of my garden. The isolation blows have hit. 
It is what it is. I have not been out, like literally over the door since last Thursday. The weather's just been abysmal. It's been torrential rain pretty much non-stop. So haven't even been able to just sit outside and get some fresh air. So that is what I'm doing today. It's still very cloudy, but at least it's dry. Uh, so that's what's up, really. Uh, but on another note, look at these pretty roses. Very nice. More coming here. Look at this one. Oh, it's so pretty. So that is what is happening. I'm just going to be walking laps for the next little while. And then I guess I'll go back inside and find something to do. But I just really needed some fresh air. Like, nobody can stay in the house and not go out for 10 days. Like, I, I, that's completely unrealistic. Like, I, you need fresh air. <laughs> So that's what I'm doing. Garden life is, I guess I'm lucky to have quite a long garden that I'm able to walk laps. Ah, never mind, never mind. I'll come back and check in with you in a little while, see what I'm doing. But yeah, this vlog is going to be ridiculous. Just apologies. Hello everybody, it's Wednesday, my dudes. Wednesday means the last day of isolation. <laughs> it's actually not been too bad. Except yesterday when I felt like I was going crazy and walked about 9,000 laps in my garden. <laughs> but otherwise, you know, it's been fine. I've uh, been keeping very busy. I told you. I've been making a lot of scrunchies, a lot of things, a lot of bows because announcement I have started a little business. It's very exciting. So if you know me in real life, I say real life because you know this is real life but a lot of my viewers probably don't know me personally but if you do know me personally and I have you on Facebook then you've probably seen that I started my own little business uh, selling scrunchies, hair accessories, bows, all this good stuff. Sorry if it's really loud, my window is open because it's about a thousand degrees in here. But yeah, started a little Facebook business. It's quite exciting. <laughs> so um, I will leave that linked below if anybody wants to check that out. Um, I'm on Facebook, uh, the company is called Savage Styles. So yeah, I'm going to leave that below if anybody wants to check it out. If you like hair accessories, scrunchies, or if you have a small child, you know a small child that likes bows and that sort of stuff, then please check it out, like, support. I don't know what to say. It's, it's quite exciting to start a new adventure. So that's what I've been keeping busy doing during this isolation. <laughs> So yes, Savage Styles, we'll leave it linked below. Please check it out. Please like the page. Uh, support small, you know. And if any of you have a small business, then please comment below. Let me know. I am, I'd love to support you as well. Uh, so that's really the update for today. Um, I know I told you last week that I was sitting on something huge. It's not this. This is, I mean, this is kind of huge as well, but this is not the huge exciting news that I have coming. Stay tuned for that. I think that will be coming very soon. Uh, anyway, gonna go and chill now. I've been pretty much working all day up until this point. Uh, so gonna have some well-deserved chill time. I think maybe watch some friends and then it'll be Love Island time. Has anybody else been watching? Who or your favourite contestants, who do you think are going to go all the way? I'm really liking Jake and Lib Liberty, but I don't know. I think with these new girls coming in, I think his head might be turned, just saying. Uh, also, I mean, I do like them all. I think Brad might be a bit of a player. Just saying, just going to put that out there. Uh, but otherwise, I, good, good cast for 2021. I do generally quite like all of them. So I guess we'll see where that goes. Um, 
If anybody wants to discuss, leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on the 2021 cast. Uh, I was not a big fan, actually, of Love Island. I'd never actually watched Love Island until last year uh, when Paige was in it because I actually know Paige personally. We grew up in the same hometown. We went to the same schools, everything, all that stuff. So, you know, I had to, I had to watch her. And then she won, didn't she? Of course. So outstanding. So that was, last year was the first time that I watched Love Island. And then this year I thought, why not? Because it was quite good. I quite enjoy it. Anyway, I've been rambling for about five minutes, so I'm going to stop rambling now and get on and I'll come back tomorrow when I'm out of isolation uh, and I'll speak to you then. Hello everyone, good morning, happy Thursday, I'm out of isolation, woohoo! Oh, it feels so good to be out again. I am currently in Asda's car park, I need to go and get my mum's birthday present. It's going to be our birthday next week, so uh, thank goodness that the isolation ended when it did or she would have been getting nothing, <laughs> but she wouldn't have minded. Anyway, so yes, uh, Asda, gonna do that. I, I'm just, I'm like so happy to be out. The time now is quarter past nine. <laughs> I was up, I mean, I'm always up early, but I, I like up, ready, let's go get out that door as soon as I can. <laughs> That's so sad, I know, but like, if anybody has been in isolation, then you'll know what it's like. Uh, anyway, gonna go get on with that and then I'll come back. I think I might head for a Starbucks because, you know, treat yourself. You've been in the house for 10 days. Might as well. Why not? So I'm going to go to Asda, get all the things, and then I will come back and check in with you in a little while. Hello, friends. I'm back. So I've been to Asda. Also went to Primark to get some materials, aka scarves for turning in scrunchies because it's so much cheaper than buying actual material. Uh, and now I've been at Starbucks. I got one of these new uh, refresher so this is the strawberry acai one uh, i seen that actually emily canham got this and she said that it, the uk version she thought was better than the american one so let's give this a try shall we first impression here goes mm. oh wow Oh, that was really nice. Mmm. It's just like strawberry juice. That's what it tastes like. Uh, very nice. Mm. I really like that. I would highly recommend that. That's good on them. Um, that's like a nice refreshing, like it says in the title, refresher, but very nice and refreshing for hot clammy days like it has been here in Scotland for the last whatever two weeks or so yeah I uh, would definitely recommend that I really like it I mean what is it probably fancy water with some strawberry syrup and some strawberries in it but very nice well done Starbucks well done hats off to you I do kind of look like I've walked straight out of the 80s today with the scrunchie and the beads but uh, that's because these are my own products so I made this uh, it's full pedal obviously I'm not a millionaire and then one of my little summer scrunchies here uh, I'm gonna take some instapics try and take some instapics for the business page uh, of these products hopefully get some good shots today uh, and get that underway because right now it's a page with no posts on it and it's not good so definitely need to get on that hello everyone happy friday i know that last clip ended quite abruptly and then i never came back i just got caught up and then it was dancing night so went to that uh it's friday afternoon been a very quick morning um again been busy i am currently i'm editing the vlog right now i realized i forgot to come back and round out so sorry about that, uh, but you know, just been busy, 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 busy bee. Uh, so rounding out now, this is already quite long. So remember, if you like this one, hit that like button. 
don't forget to subscribe and if you want to see any more content from me you can follow me on all social medias at nicholasavage22 and if you haven't already then please head over to my new facebook business page at savage styles uh, if you're interested in accessories and all that good stuff okay thanks for watching see you next time have a fun and safe weekend and i'll see you very soon bye bye